How's it going, Lordbug? Welcome to the live stream. It's been a while. There's quite a bit of lag on my part. Like, I've been playing for a little bit. And looks like the lag's a little... A little much. So if I'm not responding right away, that's probably why. I haven't really fixed this problem yet, but... Looking to use other means to... Do live streaming. Right now I'm using Elgato Capture Card. Uh, the quality is good, but it's just a little bit of a delay. And by a little bit of a delay, I mean a lot. So yeah. Alright man, good luck. Have a good one, Lord Bug. I see what's wrong. Okay. So my mic was turned up a little too high, so the gain on it was a little too high. So now it should sound a lot better. How's it going, Ram? Thank you for coming out to the live stream. My capture card live stream is still kind of weird. There's like a super, there's the delay is crazy. So so I might be typing stuff out to get it to you sooner rather than using this delay, so. Hello, 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 hello. A little bit of technical difficulties to start out this live stream. Hopefully we get all the issues 
down. Probably the biggest issue is just the delay between my capture card and what's actually happening. But we'll see how that goes. Can y'all hear the mic? Test this out. There's always, whenever I do live streams, like, I can play online for hours and it would be fine. As soon as I do live streams, there's always some kind of technical difficulty, so... Like, I want to do more of them, but it always comes back to, like, technical difficulties. And I don't want to seem like I don't know how to live stream, because I've done a few now. Uh, the only part I don't really know is to fix... The lag, but I don't know if that's a, that's a thing like that can be fixed or not. And I've only used one kind of live stream program, so maybe there's others that are better out there. I've heard of different things. Discord. I don't know if it live streams like from capture cards, but we're see. We're still learning. But we are streaming some Splatoon. I don't know how long I'll stream, but uh, I got nothing planned for tonight. I've been wanting to play some Splatoon anyway. So I've been getting some messages from people about today's video and I understand that I probably should have made it a little bit clearer, but 
I pretty much blame Nintendo for the new Splatoon accessory. When in actuality, the accessory is made from Hori, the company. I probably should have made that a little more clear. I mean, I still blame Nintendo because even though it's like a, a third party uh, accessory, I mean, it's not going to be far off from what Nintendo is putting out. So I still blame Nintendo for letting it go this far. But it is a Hori accessory, so they just let Hori license it out. So I'm a little more optimistic, but I don't I don't see Nintendo's product being any better. So that's kind of how I looked at that. Ram, I did Monster Hunter Double Cross is coming to the Switch in Japan. Yes, there is no region lock and I feel like for the JRPGs, especially like, say like Xenoblade 2, I've said before that we're probably going to get this game after Japan. So I think that if you guys are really, really big Xenoblade fans, you might want to pick this up. Like, you could probably pick up the, Jap uh, the Japanese version, and I'm sure that there would be translators in there. But I still, I'm going to stick with it. I, I, it's going to come out this year. But I think it's going to be Japan only. And then we're going to probably get it next year. That's just my personal feeling on it. I could be wrong, but that's the way it's looking. I am actually super excited about ARMS though. I can't stop I can't stop talking about ARMS. I'm probably going to make another ARMS video either maybe tomorrow maybe tomorrow or maybe I'll spend a couple days on it to make it really really good. But I'm really excited to play ARMS and I saw a couple of the bigger YouTubers like the brand ambassadors um stream it today and they showed off Twintel, they showed off Kid Cobra. So I'm super excited for ARMS and I, you know, I saw them play some of the campaign, campaign in quotations, um, but the game looks really, really good. And I think that it's going to be one of Nintendo's breakout hits. And from what I've played in the test punch, I think that this game is going to be a hit. Like... The controls are solid, and I've only played in the motion controls. Like, I... We only got an hour to play, so... In each of the test punches, so I haven't really used handheld, or... You know, I don't even have a pro controller, so... I haven't tried this the more traditional controls. But, from what I've played, and the motion controls are, like, spot on. That's probably how I'll end up playing. Uh, when I actually do get the game, but... The game looks really, really solid. I love the character design. And all throughout the test punch, I played primarily as Ribbon Girl. Because, I don't know, I just tried them all out. She was pretty much more of my style. I'm more of like the elusive. I'm not really like the big power, kind of like Master Mummy, who I thought I was going to like. But turns out he is super, super slow. So, I'll probably be using Ribbon Girl. I'll probably be using uh, Ninjara. I like more of the elusive characters. But, definitely. Arms, day one purchase. I've never doubted it. I mean, it's a fighting game. It's a motion control fighting game. I think that's what people don't really realize because, 
you know, I feel like motion control at this point in time is looked at more as, okay, this is, this is a gimmick. So people don't really take it as seriously. But this game, I mean, these aren't even Wiimotes, and this game is controlling perfectly. I never had problems with, with the controls. The only problem I had was finding out how to lock on to an opponent, like in the 3v3 matches, 2v3, or I'm sorry, the 2v2. It was hard for me at first to know how to lock on. So that was confusing, but I got the hang of it pretty quick. Fortunately, I, uh, Nintendo didn't send me a review copy. At least, I mean, I would, I would definitely be playing that right now. But, um, I'm still, I'm still excited for Splatoon 2, and, you know, we, we played the test fire. I wish the test fire was near the actual game itself, like, what was it, like, last month or something? I wish we got the test fire closer to when we actually, when the game's gonna come out. Because now, we played the test fire for, I mean, I, I forgot how long it was. I think it was like a week, but I want more of the game. So now I'm stuck playing Splatoon, which I don't mind at all. For those of you watching, welcome to my channel. In the description is all of the kind of links to how to contact me and how to add me. So I have my Wii U uh, ID up there, my Switch code, and my Twitter account. Of course, Twitter is the best place to reach me if you guys are wondering when I'll be doing the Q&As, when I will be live streaming. So if you guys want to add me on Twitter, that would be awesome. You can always add me on Switch when Ar when Arms comes out. I will definitely be streaming that. So you guys probably want to add me on there if you want to play on the live stream. And also my Wii U ID. I will be streaming Splatoon pretty often. So if you guys want to add me on there, that would be great as well. But uh, welcome everyone to the live stream. Like I said before, I don't really know how long I will be live streaming. I just wanted to make another live stream video because we had a lot of success with the with the prior live streams. Met a lot of cool people. And I uh, thought I'd make a part two. And hopefully, if all goes well, I will be uploading this onto my channel so you guys can watch it at any time. But yeah, my Wii U ID is in the description if you guys want to join the live stream. And if we get enough people, maybe we can start a private room or something like that. But in the meantime, I will just be playing some Splatoon for you guys. If you have any questions for me at all, feel free to ask in the chat. I kind of wanted to do a Splatoon slash live Q&A. So if you guys have any questions about the channel... Um, about the future of the channel, if you guys want to collab, I'm always taking some collab information. I would love to get on other YouTube channels as well as have other YouTubers on my channel. I feel like it's a good mix, especially when you get multiple voices about a topic rather than just me. Because sometimes I do come off as a little biased. But it'd be nice to have some other people on this channel. I have been in talks with a few YouTubers. Um, a couple that are really, really bigger than mine. Um, so we've been kind of talking back and forth on whether we want to collaborate. So maybe I'll appear on their channels or they will appear here. I've always wanted to get a podcast going. So maybe we can 
A lot of, a lot of ideas coming. So uh, I hope you guys stick around for more of that. And uh, I'll have more information in the coming months. But I've already been in talks with a few YouTubers about collabing and making some more original content for you guys. And uh, when I first started this channel, actually, I always viewed this as my chance to start a gaming podcast. And as I started making videos, I kind of liked the short bursts of just making, you know, news updates, rants, discussions. But at some point, I'm going to want to kind of break out from that and make more and more, like, original content. I've always wanted to do podcasts. Uh, I do have a friend that games with me as well. He's not really a big hardcore gamer, so I don't know how much information I could possibly get out of him on a podcast. But I have been in talks, like I said, with some, some much bigger YouTubers. Like, 20 to 40,000 subscriber YouTubers. Uh, which I, I think would be awesome, because then I would get a bunch of exposure. And uh, maybe if you guys didn't know them, you could find out who they are. So, pretty much some big things happening. Ram, I've noticed you said you've been playing with Min Min a lot. See, that's one of the things that, I don't know, a lot of people have been playing with Min Min. Um, I, I played with her a few times. I, I will say this, I do like the, the dragon arm. Um, but also I think, uh, who is it? Helix has it as well. So, I don't know, I played with Min Min a few times. I didn't really see the hype, but she is a nice elusive character. Um, and I was using her a little bit, so someone answer me in the chat. If there is, is there a, uh, is there a test punch tonight? Cause I would definitely stream that because I've been wanting to play more arms. I think the first one, I think the first one might be tomorrow. I think it's tomorrow. But uh, I will I will try to stream that as well, because I heard that in the new uh, in the new test punch, they're actually going to let us play the basketball mode, and they're also going to I heard that they're going to let us use the other characters. I could be wrong though. I think that they're going to keep some things a secret, but uh, basketball and I think the target practice is confirmed. So. We're going to be able to dunk people in some hoops. That mode looks pretty cool. I'm really disappointed about V-Ball because it looked like a cool little minigame mode. But, I don't know. I just didn't like it. I liked the 1v1, but I, didn't, I hated the team V-Ball match. It just was not good. Something that I thought was going to be a lot better. I don't know what it is, though. It's like only some of the arms are good because a lot of the arms are too slow. So by the time the ball reaches the ground, like you're still punching in, the, in, in midair. So I don't know. Maybe I'm choosing the wrong arms. Like I said, guys, before, if you want to play some Splatoon or just have me as a friend on your Wii U or Switch, all of my links are in the description below. You guys can also add me on Twitter to know when I will be live streaming next. And also when I will be doing the Q&As. So that will all be in the description. You guys can add me on those platforms. And, uh, yeah. But other than that, I will be... Uh, 
streaming some Splatoon. You guys can also ask me some questions in the chat. Always down to hear more from you guys. But uh, thank you for coming out. Oh yeah, we dominated this one. I've been winning a lot today. For those of you who also, a little bonus is, I put my Twitter in the description and I actually tweeted out today um, if anyone wanted to be in my gameplay videos because for the video today, I was actually streaming this morning. So if you guys would have seen that Twitter announcement, you guys could have hopped on your Wii U could have been in the could have been in the uh, stream as well, and I totally would have gave you guys a shout out. But I would, if I was you guys, I would expect a new video tomorrow. I'm probably gonna give my opinions on arms and uh, a few important, exciting announcements from this channel. And it has to do with growth, has to do with collaboration. So all exciting things happening. I've been in talks with a few YouTubers. And uh, hopefully I can get some deals done. Because I'm really, I really want a few people to talk about a few games. Because they, they're pros at talking about those games. So I'm always trying to get new voices on this channel. And they all, I mean, the voices don't have to be well-known YouTubers either. If, if you guys just want to collab with me, send me some audio, send me some, you know, ways to connect with you. How's it going, Angel? Welcome to the channel. So yeah, I'm always looking for new ways. I want to do a couple different segments. Um, and I want to do them about specific games. So I would love to have different voices on the channel. Um, I already have someone who we just got to meet up. He's from across the world. So he's on a totally different time zone. So I think right now it's like midnight for him. Uh, but yeah, it'd be cool to get some more people on here. And if you guys have any suggestions of YouTubers that you think I should go after or you think would collab with me, leave it in the chat. Let me know, guys. That'd be awesome. So my Wii U code is in the description. Type it out again for you guys. If you guys want to add me, join the game with me. That'd be cool. I usually play Splatoon quite a bit. Um, I do play Smash sometimes. So if you guys are big into playing some online Smash, I do play occasionally. I'm more uh, Splatoon. I'm more on the Switch. But... Uh, Definitely won't stop me from playing some Wii U. Especially with you guys. Like.
I don't, if anyone knows, uh, let me know if there is a test punch tonight. I think it starts tomorrow. I think, because June 2nd rings a bigger bell than June 1st. I think there's like three. I think there's like three tomorrow or three for the rest of the tense, test punch. But I did find out today that the the new test punch is going to feature two new modes. So we're going to be able to play the basketball mode, which is cool. You can uh, dunk people in the hoop. And it's also going to feature the target mode. So the mode that you guys have been seeing with the, the punch that extends, and you can kind of twist it, hit the targets. So those two modes are going to be offered in this next test punch, next go around. It's going to be interesting to see if they include characters like Twin or Kid Cobra or Bite and Bark. So I don't know. That's that's going to be cool. How's it going, Xenolith? Welcome to the channel. Like always, if you guys are new to the channel, I would appreciate if you guys hit the subscribe button. If you really want to keep in touch and uh, make sure you never miss a video, go ahead and hit that notification bell. June 2nd. Okay, Ram. Thank you for that. I heard that we we're going to be able to, to play the two new modes. I don't know if we're going to be able to use the, the new characters. That would be awesome. So definitely looking forward to that. I really, really want to use Kid Cobra. He looks very elusive, but at the same time... He looks like pretty strong. Like I've seen some gameplay of him. Definitely a guy that I could. Uh, definitely a guy that I could use. But I think Ribbon Girl is gonna be my main, guys. I was killing it with her. I I actually the last test punch, believe it or not, I did not lose one battle. I didn't lose one battle with with, with Ribbon Girl. With Ribbon Girl, I did lose a couple battles with Springman. And Helix, I just cannot, I cannot figure him out. I cannot figure the playstyle out. His weapons are just too bizarre. They're way too slow for me. So, uh, yeah. It was not looking good for me with Helix. But yeah, once again, guys, the uh, the video I made today, I didn't specify that this was a third-party accessory from the company Hori. So a lot of people were on me about, you know, is this an, like, why did I blame Nintendo? Um, that sort of thing. But I know it's a third-party accessory, but I'm still disappointed because even if Nintendo comes out with an accessory of their own, it's not going to look much different. So that's the reason why I was most mostly disappointed. How's it going, man? Welcome to the live stream. Xenolith, you're playing some Splatoon. Are you playing right now? You can totally add me. And uh, you can be a part of the live stream. You can join my game if you'd like. might change weapons I was doing really really well with this weapon I primarily use just this weapon and this loadout but lately I don't know first of all I hate the fact that you can't choose the level in Splatoon that's always been my biggest gripe with Splatoon but I don't know the these levels the two levels that are playing right now I dislike 
So earlier we had some some good levels when I was recording some gameplay for the video today. But these I can't stand these levels. But Splatoon 2 uh, apparently didn't fix this problem. And uh, so now, I mean, they lowered the time. I think this original game, it's like three hours, four hours. But now it's two hours. Oh, no, Xenolith. That is terrible. Yeah, this is, uh, this is unranked. I haven't played Splatoon in a while, so I didn't want to play rank just yet but I, I think I might switch that because I really don't like these levels Got him. But yeah, this is a unranked regular match. I think I might switch to the ranked. I need to get my rank up anyway. I think it's like a C minus or something like that. Oh. Those rollers, man. Got a bomb battle. I know where you are, bro. Right around this corner. That was close. Got him. See, I am good with this gun. If I'm not distracted by the live chat, I am good with this gun. If I'm looking down, always get distracted. Where are you going, man? He took him with me, but that's a kill. A kill's a kill. Oof. Looks like this one's going to be a little close. I think we won. I definitely think we won. So for those of you who are curious about what I have planned for the next day, I have a video coming out tomorrow about arms. Not too sure what kind of style I'm going to do with the video, so if anyone has any suggestions, that would be awesome. But I'm probably going to do an arms-related video, and I might do a arms live stream. So if you guys are interested in that, 
that might be coming tomorrow. So yeah, it'll probably be like today. I'm probably going to do a video. I'm going to release it probably early afternoon, uh, early morning, and then do a live stream probably around this time. Seems like a pretty solid schedule that I've been doing. Something that I want to start doing more of. I, I definitely want to do more live streams. Uh, I meet a lot of cool people in these streams. And also, it gives, a, it gives an opportunity for you guys to add me on some platforms and maybe sometimes play. Play a few rounds. Any of you guys playing ARMS tomorrow? I saw a bunch of bigger kind of mainstream ambassadors streaming it out today. And they streamed quite a bit, actually. I was surprised. I guess the, uh, the primary or the uh, part of the embargo was lifted today. which allowed YouTubers to stream part of the campaign and show off some of the new characters, which I thought was awesome. But I'm psyched to try out Twintel. I'm excited to try out Kid Cobra. I love his design. Uh, not so much Bite and Bark. I've talked about this before. And I don't think... I don't know. I just... There's a lot... There's a lot going on as it is. To have a two-character person in a... Like a 2v2, let's say. It's just... I don't know. It's a lot. Dark Knight, you're more than welcome to join. You just want to add me. The Wii U code is in the description. I'm going to probably switch out anyway, so it's probably a good time to join. All right, let's see what I got. I got two different rollers, one with a super squid, it looks like, one with a couple seekers, Kraken, Carbon. I don't know which is better. Uh, I might be doing some private battles. If we get enough people to join, then that would probably do it for me. So I'm going to use this roller. But yeah, I mean, I don't think we have enough people right now. We're going to do some rank battles, though. Right. 
Yeah, Ram, I, I can uh, I can kind of see that. I have to work a little bit tomorrow, too. But uh, I should be able to get in the live stream, at least, or take some gameplay from it and make a video the next day. Um, but I'm excited to see what exactly they're going to let us play with. I know that the, of course, the basketball mode, I've, I've said this before, is confirmed. I really, really want to use Twintel, though. She looks really cool. This is my first ranked match in like a long time. Probably should have used my best weapon. So we got at least one. He's got the high road. So right now we are playing some Splat Zones ranked matches. Exciting stuff. Like I said, I haven't played a lot of ranked matches. I don't even usually use rollers. Yeah, I honestly I haven't been above I haven't been above B minus. So this is going to be a very, very close match. I'm actually focusing. I'm not talking too much. I've been trying to rank up, like, legit for a little bit now. But it's so hard. Like, even, even getting out of the C rank is really, really hard on this. Send a friend request. Thank you very much. I'll add you, uh... Probably after this match, maybe a, maybe a couple more. There we go. Not bad, not bad. You can all see my ugly rank now. I think I'm I'm think I'm like a C minus. Yeah, C minus. So we'll do one more. Zeno, I will add you definitely right after this match. I'm not, I don't usually get put on like good teams. So kind of want to just play this. So if you guys want to play, all you have to do is add me. My ID is in the description. My switch code is in the description if you guys want to play with me. Probably be playing ARMS tomorrow. So if you guys want to play with me during the test punch. And also if you guys want to follow me on Twitter. That. Twitter is also in the description. 
But right after this match, I'm going to add all my friend requests and then maybe start a private room if we have enough people. But if not, we'll take it from there. We'll keep playing ranked matches. Damn. I don't know what I'm doing. All right, we're going to send out a bunch of seekers. Hey, triple kill. There we go. And let's kill the whole team while we're at it. Not that. Send uh, send some more seekers out here. Seekers are underrated. <laughs> Let's kill someone else. Let's kill someone else. That one didn't hit. Let's kill them all again. How's it going, Inkly? Nice to see you on the stream. If you guys are new to the channel, I would appreciate a subscribe from you guys. I do daily Nintendo Nintendo videos pretty much every day. If you want to see the one today, it is about the new Hori accessory that was revealed for Splatoon. So pretty exciting stuff there. We are doing ranked matches right now for the Splatoon on Wii U. So if you guys want to join, all you have to do is add me. The uh, the links to add me are in the description. And I'm just having fun throwing Seekers at people. That's pretty much my life right now. Looks like we got this one. Three, two, one. There we go. Another win. Hopefully we get out of C C minus rank today. I'm gonna go check. Thank you, Ankly. I'm gonna actually go check the friend request right now. So maybe we can get in a couple matches or so. Uh, last live stream we did, we actually had a full match. We had people waiting to come in, so hopefully that's the case this time. So we're not going to join. We're going to check some friend requests now. Time to be famous, guys. Hey, you're all famous. You're all famous. All right. Ank just got you. And then I think this is Zeno. All right. Cool. How's it going, Spoil? Splatoon, Splatoon, Splatoon. Maybe we can get a rank, uh, a match going. Let's see if we can.
So we got Ankly in here. Yeah, I usually just do Turf Wars. Um, let's see. Got Ashlyn in here. Zeno, is that you? Is Ashlyn you? This is what it's going to have to be for right now. Additional skills. What are you talking about, Ram? Because... I haven't really heard about Splatoon 2 other than what I've played on the test fire. Um, so I'm not too sure. Additional skills that they're adding to Splatoon. I'm not too sure. Ankly, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you don't have a teammate. But uh, yeah, we'll try. Uh, we'll do some stuff right now. Again, uh, just a reminder for you guys watching out there, if you want to join in the game, all you have to do is add me. The links are in the description. And uh, we have two versus one right now. So if you guys want to even up the teams a little bit, more than welcome to come out and uh, play around with us. We have Enkly and Xenolith in the match right now. Thank you for coming out, guys. We need to get Enkly a partner if you guys want to join. The ID is Chef P Mac. I'll actually type it out in the chat for you guys. You can join me on Wii U. Also, my Switch code is in there. Aaron, how's it going, man? I actually forget. Did you play Wii? Uh, did you play Splatoon with us last time? We're actually looking for at least one more player.
There we go. We got Hannah in from last time. Uh, we're going to do one more. Uh, okay, Aaron. Yeah, that's right. We're going to do one more turf war. We're going to do... Which one did I really, really like? Do Camp Triggerfish. And actually, I'm going to go with... I don't know if Hannah... If Hannah, if you're in the chat... Because I know Hannah was in the live stream last time. But that's awesome. We have... Uh, 2v2 now. There we go. Okay. I knew you were here, Hannah. It, it's so weird because people's names on YouTube are so different from their actual, like, Wii U IDs. Um, like, even mine, I'm Patrick in real life, but, you know, obviously I'm Arwing. But my Switch account, it is Arwing Attack. Uh, but my Switch, for the millionth time, <laughs> is in the details, the description, so if you guys want to add me. Play some arms tomorrow. Mario Kart 8, possibly. Oh, that was a wrong move. Gonna seek him out. That didn't work. Seeker. I like that we both have seekers. Seekers are so underrated. Anyone got love for Seekers? I actually just really, really started using them. Uh, because they came, of course, on this class. But I really like them, especially in, like, some of the more, like, flatter levels. Oh god, that was the wrong move. You got me. Hannah got me. That's cool, Aaron. If you want to add me, actually, I could accept it after this round or somewhere in between. I don't know if you have Splatoon at all. But for those of you who are just joining, we are doing a live stream with subs officially now. Before, I was playing kind of ranked in regular matches by myself. But we got some... People to join so if you guys want to join the name is in the description I would still love to have even more people I totally agree. Salmon Run looks amazing. That's probably what I'll be playing later on.
But yeah, the campaign looks looks so so good. Salmon Run is exactly what this franchise was missing. Like, I'm a sucker for horde modes. Like, more like more recently, kind of like Gears of War. Like, I, I played a little bit. Uh, cool, Aaron. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. If you want to join, uh, we do have some spots open. But back to Salmon Run. Thank you, Adriana. Salmon Run, one of those, you know, modes that I think none of us knew that we needed, but it looks so, so good. Aaron, I think you could just join. Yeah, Zeno, I completely agree. Salmon Run is, is going to be so, so good. I'm so excited. Those little creatures are like the cutest things. And then those... Those big boss guys, they look awesome. It's just going to be so much fun. And, like, I don't have a lot of followers. Like, I'll be the first one to admit it. So, I think the 2v2 makes a lot of sense. Good morning to you, too. It is actually 7.52 where I am. I am on the East Coast. But yeah, welcome to the live stream. Always happy to have some new subscribers in. Like we have Hannah. Hannah's pretty, uh, she was uh, in my old live streams. And then we have Enkly. We also have Zeno in the new stream. So if you guys want to join the stream, you are more than welcome to. You're getting smoked right now. That's what we were missing. That part right up there. I think we're going to be playing Splat Zones from now on. Thank you very much, Adriana. It means a lot to me. Don't know if you have a Wii U or a Splatoon, but we're playing right now. Subs only match. So you do have to be a subscriber to join. Or it is preferred, actually. I would appreciate it. Right now, it's not looking too good for my team, though. I must say that. I actually just checked and I was on 1%. <laughs> I was on 1%. My computer was on 1%. So I just saved the live stream by plugging it in. We got smacked around. Good game, guys. Very, very good game. So I'm going to go right now and I'm going to ch A plus Hannah. Oh my God gonna check right now for all of the let's go check some new people get some new people in so thank you spoilerina I do Nintendo video
every day or every other day. And I cover... Adriana, you can add me. It's in the description. But I cover a lot of things. So I cover speculation. Um, I give a lot of insight to my opinions. I'll be doing a ton of E3 speculation videos. And yeah, so uh, if you guys want to subscribe to more, that would be awesome. I do live streams every so often. I'm going to start doing more live streams because I feel like I meet a lot of cool people. And whenever I get comments on my channel videos, it's nice to see familiar names. So it's cool. Like, oh, I played, I played Splatoon or that guy kicked my ass in Splatoon. Like it's, it's really cool. But, um, right now I just do Splatoon. I do some, I've done a Mario Kart 8 stream, but I haven't kept it on. Like I didn't keep it on as like a video, but this one I'll actually be putting, like I'll, I'll put on my channel. So if you guys want to rewatch this, all the shenanigans. Yeah. I hope we can be friends too. All right, so we are going to do one more match. We're going to do one more match, uh, and then I will add some people. We're going to go, me and Hannah, the OGs, the OGs of the R-Wing Attack subscribers. We're going to go against the newbies. And, uh, yeah, we'll see if... Uh, the oldies can win. I'm still using the roller. I don't usually use a roller. So we'll see how this goes. Yeah, so spoiler arena, if you just want to stick around, we're just going to do this match. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to check my friend request right after this match. So if you guys want to add me. And we will get some matches going. But right now we're just going to finish this match. So everyone, if you want to add me, the name is Chef P Mac on Wii U. And we will get a match going right after this. Hopefully we get some more players. I see a sniper. They're all after me. They're after me, Lucky Charms. The funny part is I'm, I'm Irish, so that makes sense. We're going to get one of them. We got one of them. I saw you from a mile away. I thought I did turf war, but I guess I didn't do turf war. Oh wait, I did do turf war. I thought I did splat zones, that's what I meant. Oh, just made it. Oh, ho, ho. so Aaron, I actually work in a, just a little restaurant. I live in Providence, Rhode Island. And we specialize in like smaller desserts. So I do a lot of like small kind of stuff. I do cakes as well. Cakes is kind of my specialty. I love making cakes for my family, my friends. So, yeah. Oh, no. I almost got crushed. How? 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 <laughs> Ink. What the heck?
Oh my god. Oh god. That sniper though. Oh my god, you guys are killing me here. Damn. <laughs> I don't know. It's it's kind of close. I think I think orange has it. Gotcha, Ank. Let's finish the game off. Ank. Oh, wow. We won. Holy crap. Oh, Aaron, what do you do, man? Are you a... Uh... What are you? Dark Angel's in here. Word, word, word. I'm going to go check real quick, guys. All right, so we do have a friend request. Two friend requests. We got Nasty Boots. You are famous. And Fanboy. All right. So hopefully we can get those two people in. And I saw Adriana. So that's awesome. So let's do this again. I think I'm going to do splat zones. So if you guys just want to join, we're going to do Urchin Underpass is by far my favorite. Oh, Aaron, it's nice. Nice. I, I, uh... I feel for you, man. Being a chef is no joke. Long hours. And, uh, probably the most underappreciated, probably the most underappreciated, uh, line of work that there is because, you know, chefs really, really put a lot out there. And I don't know. It's, we're not always appreciated at the end of the day because we're behind the scenes, you know? Spoilerine is the fanboy. Okay. Adriana, I will now refer to you as Dark Angel. So, Adriana, that's the last time you'll hear that. So, Dark Angel. All right, let's start this. Let's start this junk. If you guys, just a quick reminder, because I haven't said it a million times. If you guys want to join the live stream, add me on the Wii U. My name is Chef P. Mac. And uh, we can get this going. It looks like it's me, Hannah, and Dark Angel against Ashlyn, Fanboy, and Ankly. I think this is a pretty even match. So if you guys don't know, you've never been to a live stream before, what I do specifically is the person that finishes first will actually be transferred to my team. So the person that gets the biggest score will be transferred to my team. So if you're not on my team now and you want to be, don't worry. Just perform. Put some work in. We got this. Aaron, yes, I'm going to have to check out your stuff, man. Do you have a YouTube channel as well? Killing it. 
Oh, Ram, you're a caregiver? That is... That's very nice. My, uh... Both my mom and my sister are both in the health industry. Both nurses. Um... Yeah. I think you guys are super underappreciated as well, but, I mean... People love you. About to splat some fools. No YouTube? Okay. Yeah, I think you uh, you told me to check you out. I probably got a little sidetracked. I apologize about that. I think I just got a follow from you, Aaron. I'm not too sure. Not doing good, guys. Alright, let's do this. Let's do this. They lost control. There's a chance. No, there's not. Let's see where we're at. So Hannah. Hannah was in first. I didn't see that shit. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on a second, guys. Got to look back at the footage to see who is now on my team. So, Ank. Me, Hannah, and Ank. Sweet. Uh, Aaron, my food, I, I put some of it on my personal Facebook and on my, my Instagram. I uh, don't know if you want to add me on there. Alana Bull, thank you. That's my Instagram. Every open eye is my Instagram. Some of my food's on there. I think some of it. Alana, I will add you after this game. Hopefully we can get some more people in here. We're only two away from a full room. So, yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. This isn't... This isn't Turf War, Pat. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh God. Alana. What do they usually call you, Elena? Oh my God. I feel like I have a lot of female, like people coming out to the live stream. Which is really, really cool. I looked at the analytics finally of my channel and it looks like primarily for the most part it's all guys I do have some female followers but I'm just it's always curious to me like who who's my demographic 
Not that I'll change my con like content to cater towards that, but it's always interesting to know. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh god, we got a fourth guy in here. You know what? We pretty much dominated. So we'll give you the fourth guy for right now. And uh, yeah, we'll do this again. I don't know guys, what do you think? Uh, I've been using the, the roller a little bit. I don't know if you guys want to see another weapon. Most of you guys here are actually in the game. I might go back to the, the gun I had earlier. I must say though, <laughs> I have some of the dopest followers like you you guys are all super nice like I've definitely been on some other channels and it's like immature like like just negative people you guys seem really really cool so thank you for coming out of course like always. Alright, we about to take this. They got four people though. We it's three on four right now, but we have a pretty solid team. Trying to keep up here. Let me go help you. Oh no, let me go help you out. I got you, Hannah. No, I don't. Oh god. So they got control. They got four people, so this is gonna be pretty tough to come back. Oh god. see if we can do this all right we got some seekers going out I think we got this man all right we got the splat zone back Oh God. All right, we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. I don't know guys, I might change out my weapon soon. Eight. Bam. Sweet. Not bad, not bad, not bad. All right, fanboy. All 
right, so I'm going to... I'm going to change my weapon real quick. I'm also going to check my friend requests, which we do have a friend request. And, okay. All right. So now I'm going to change my weapon out. All right. Change the weapon out. Here it is, the old reliable. All right, let's do another battle. So, do you have another room opening up? Oh my god, spoilerina, jeez. I th honestly, I think the highest that I was was probably B. But then I I really just stopped playing. Oh god, we got a full team. All right, so we're going to do a turf war. Here we go. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. Let's see. I got to I got to go with my uh got to go with my boys here or my girls rather. Got Hannah, we got Ank, and Dark Angel, you've been pretty cool, so we're going to have you on there. Just so you guys know, the winner or the top performer on the other team, this is a little rule that I've been doing throughout kind of my live streams, but the, the leader on the team that I'm going against will go on my team sorry about that <laughs> but uh yeah so if you guys do well you'll be on my team don't worry i think everyone will get a chance uh everyone will get a chance but yeah also guys i will type out my wii u id if you guys want to add me on wii u you can join the live stream right now we do have a full room but you never know people could leave you never quite know what could happen but we are doing turf war right now in probably my favorite level in the game Yeah, this is this is all reliable. This is Bay right here. I don't know why I wasn't use, using this gun. I do like using rollers. I feel like I'm I feel like I think I'm better than what I am with rollers. But yeah. Oh god. So guys, welcome all to the live stream. I feel like we've had we have a lot more people here now. We do have a full room for those of you who are wondering, but if you want to join the live stream and add me on all my platforms, I put all of my links in the description. You can add me on Twitter, add me on Switch, however you want to add me. But as of right now, we do have a full room. Nasty boots. Got gotcha, you, man. Thank you guys for the ad. Thank you for the subscribes as well. If you guys are doing that, that would be much appreciated. 
Fairly new channel, for those of you who are new, I do make videos about Nintendo related topics. Um, pretty much post daily. Or every other day. I try to, I try to be pretty relevant, like, I don't post once a week, so... If you want a channel that is going to post consistently, a channel that's going to post about a variety of things, I'm probably that channel to go to. I do a lot of different things too as well. Top fives. I do reviews. Um, and actually, some exciting stuff is in the works for the future. So, uh, I was going to make a video about it. But I've been talking to a lot of YouTube channels, some that are a lot bigger than mine, like I'm talking like 40, 50, even like 100,000. We've been in conversations with possibly collaborating. Um, and it's to a point where I've been talking to a few different people and we're pretty close to making videos together which would be very beneficial to me because I am, of course, a very small YouTube channel. So, yeah, I think it'd be beneficial for, for me and for everyone involved. Hopefully build this channel up a little bit. Spoiler Arena, I am going to get Splatoon 2. Um, I don't really pre-order games too much, just because like they're always going to be in stock. I usually go the first day, though, if I'm really interested in a game. Um, Splatoon 2 is definitely going to be a day one purchase. ARMS, now that I've played it, is going to be a day one purchase. And besides those two games, and of course Super Mario Odyssey and whatever else is revealed... I don't know if I'm going to get too many too many more games day one. Um, obviously, I would love to play games like Skyrim. And, you know, I, I've i been wanting to play Ukulele, even though it's been getting terrible reviews. But, uh, yeah, that's just kind of two games that I've been wanting to get. Arms looks super, super cool, though. And uh, I might even do some live streams of that tomorrow. So, lot to look forward to tomorrow. Probably two more videos will be up tomorrow. Oh my god. Cool, cool, cool. Good game, guys. we're going to continue this. I like the teams. Let's give you guys someone else.
So I asked this before that there, but there's definitely more people in the chat now. Uh, any of you guys checking out arms tomorrow? I know it's the second round of the test punch and they're actually adding in two modes. They're adding in the basketball mode and they're adding in the target practice mode from what I've heard. So, uh, we might also see, uh, some new characters revealed. So yeah, kind of curious to see if you guys are going to check that out tomorrow. Fire Scream, you are more than welcome to add me. I will check after this game if you do, and uh, we can get you in. We actually have one spot left. So if you want to add me, the name is in the description. It's Chef P. Mac. Sorry about that. We did have a full room. Uh, doesn't look like we have friend requests, so that was kind of pointless. But we can go back to playing. I'm thinking some good old-fashioned turf war. Haven't played the towers in a while. I think we should have one more person. All right, sweet. We're going to switch up some teams here. So, Enkly, I actually don't have any of the Splatoon Amiibo. Can you guys actually tell me what they do? Because I've been wondering what they do. I've seen a few in the, st in the stores. 
but I never knew what they did, so I never got them. Oh, they unlock gear? That's pretty cool. Yeah, I never knew what they did. Are they rare? Because I've, I've seen a, quite a few of them in the stores. If they're rare, I'm going to probably be a little bummed because I, pr I could have got them. Oh, they're not rare anymore? Okay. Yeah, it seems like uh, Amiibos kind of like... They go from being super rare and hard to find and like you have to sell your kidney to get one. And then they're like everywhere. They're in like bins in GameStop. I feel like Breath of the Wild Amiibo is still pretty rare. Like I only have the Link Archer. Breath of the Wild, though, guys. Oh, my God. What a game. I, I don't... I really don't think that we're ever going to get a traditional Zelda game ever again after Breath of the Wild because everyone's going to want the open world. And I am actually fine with that. I think Breath of the Wild completely knocked it out of the park. Um, So, so good. Like, such a great game. And if anyone messes with you, this is for everyone in the chat right now. If anyone messes with you and says that Nintendo doesn't make good games, let them play Breath of the Wild, even for five minutes. Because that is Nintendo at its full potential. So good. So, so good. We are getting erupted. You think so, Aaron? I feel like a lot of people, like, I feel like the new Zelda has captured some of the, some new fans. Like, I feel like Zelda is definitely something that is, there's still a lot of new fans for. So, I don't know. So Aaron, my biggest my biggest point to that was I feel like a lot of people don't take Nintendo seriously. And ever since the Wii, um people don't take Nintendo seriously. It's it's always like, oh, what's the next kitty game that they're gonna make? So that's kind of my point with it. People don't really look at Nintendo as a serious company but game game design game development Nintendo is the best like full on full on
Enkly, oh my god, Preach. Splatoon is so competitive, and by far, you know, I, I used to play, I used to play Call of Duty a ton, and honestly, I've never had as much fun as, with Call of Duty as I have with Splatoon. A completely underrated game. Yes, there's no blood, you know, there's no, like, gore and stuff, but the charm of it is just so, so great, like, people need to need to play Splatoon, and the amount of people that have never played Splatoon makes me really, really sad. That is true, Aaron. Yeah, we could see a more like traditional top-down game on the Switch, but I don't think we're gonna be seeing we're gonna see Zelda for a while. All right, so I have an idea, guys. And Enkly, you kind of just gave me an idea. What if for Halloween we got like like a red ink or like a green kind of ghouly ink for Halloween? They definitely need to capitalize on some events and some some holidays. I think that that would be super, super cool. How's it going, Austin? Imagine if they did, like, one rated M, like, blood level, where it was just blood. That would be super funny. It'll never happen, but... We can dream. You guys are down with the blood level. That would be so, so cool. I feel like with all the parental controls, like, they could definitely get that done. Like, how's it going, Giordana? Very nice to have you in the live stream. If you want to add me on any of my Nintendo consoles, all of the links are in the descriptions. You can also subscribe to the channel. I do daily Nintendo content. I know you guys absolutely killed it. I think my highest ever, I think my highest was ever was 10. And I got like most of them with seekers. I think I got like a five kill streak. But yeah, 10's pretty impressive.
26. Sweet. I'll, uh, I'll accept it after this game. And I will get back to you on that. I believe we do have a full room right now. But you never know what could happen. Twenty-three. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. Now that I think about it. Well, well, my style of play. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I'm much more of a cover the ground type of guy. Like, I'll definitely kill people, I'll fight people, but I'm much more of a defensive player. That's a great point, Aaron. Um, I've defended Nintendo ever since they put out the Wii, simply because... They went completely against what the industry was doing. When the industry, like Microsoft and Sony, were going for power, Nintendo was going for pure enjoyment. And it's, it's hard to be a Nintendo fan, especially now, because not a lot of people take them seriously, like I've said before. But you can't deny the amount of skill and talent that is in the Nintendo team. So... That's that's my stance on Nintendo. I I'm I will be a Nintendo fan as long as they keep giving us great games. Like I, I don't I don't feel uh I don't see myself running away anytime soon. I'm right there with you. I support Nintendo. If they continue making great games, I don't see why I wouldn't support them. It's kind of like a it's a two-way street. Oh shit. Sorry guys. I promised, I promised, I promised. All right. Let's go to friend request. Sorry about that, guys. All right. So let's start a brand new room. We'll see who joins first. And uh, we're gonna keep it, keep it pretty chill here with Urchin Underpass. Curtis Fam is back here, everyone. He is an OG R Wing live streamer. All right, we're, we're going to put as many OG people as we can. I think that's it. <laughs> uh, we'll put. Yeah, I think that's it. We'll try this. Oh. 
What am I doing? All right. So we got the OGs versus the newbies. Uh, we can do... Let's do tower control after this. And, uh, yeah. Good luck, guys. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the Nintendo Dads podcast, but I was watching it last night. It went really, really late. I'm surprised that I stayed up for it. It ended like 2 a.m. my time. But uh, Josh from the BitBlock, I don't know if you guys are big BitBlock fans. He announced that he leaked, he was the one who leaked the Super Smash Bros. images. I, <laughs> I could not stop laughing because for those of you who don't know, he's a pretty... You either love him or hate him. He's very critical about Nintendo. And uh, he made a video today detailing uh, his process of making them. Such a good design and such a clever idea to make a fake E3 leak. I wish I was that good. But um, super funny. If you go watch the show, he, he really, really trolled everyone. Green takes it. All right, so my new best friend, Spoilerina, said she wants tower control. So we're going to do that. See you, man. Thank you for coming out. As always, keep a lookout for those Q&A videos, announcements.
Oh god, four on two. Oops. That's not good. Good luck. Ankly, I feel your pain, man. For not having a lot of people, you guys are doing pretty good. Hopefully we can get a full battle in there next time. I think I got some new people joining. Sweet, never mind. So I got to ask this because I don't think I've ever taken like subscriber requests, but what kind of videos did you, do you guys want to see in the future? Probably going to be doing some more live streams. I like doing the top fives and also the Q and A's. What other videos would you like seeing? I'm thinking of maybe doing a podcast with guests on, but, uh, let me know what you guys think about that because I'm curious on what you guys want to see. Analyzation of like what specific games or like Oh, God. Okay, I have trailers. 
Yeah. I can definitely do that. I don't know. The only reason why I ask is because I always wanted to reach out to some of the YouTubers that I follow. And I think that having you guys kind of join the conversation and give me some ideas would be awesome because I would like to do... Obviously, you guys are my subs, so I want to see... I want to do things that you guys want to watch. Oh, fuck. Welcome to the stream, Uncle Emu. Zeno, we miss you over here doing some doing some rank matches. That's pretty cool. Do you? Do you? Ethan sent a friend request. Okay, man, I'll check that after the match. If you guys want to also subscribe to the channel, that would be much appreciated. Let me get out for one second, guys. I'm going to add some people. Oops. All right. Let's see. Let's see who's famous. Andy and Ethan. Let's 
Sweet. All right, let's get back. And uh, let's create some private battles going on. Whoever joins first. Good luck guys thank you for everyone that has come out so far if you want to add me on all of my platforms the links are in the description if you want to join the channel a subscribe would be much appreciated for those of you who don't know i put up nintendo related videos almost every day i would say that i maybe skip a day or two in between and uh, if you guys have any more video ideas for me I would gladly take them. I do top fives, Q and A's, uh, analyze it. Uh, eh, we do some kind of, we do analyzing here. I, uh, I'm in the, with a bunch of YouTube, not a bunch, but a few YouTubers on where to start collabing. I've talked to a few, a few are, I would say pretty close to happening. So uh, maybe expect some guys in the future to be on the show, or ladies. But uh, definitely some exciting stuff coming up. He has, you know, it's tough. Ranked is tough. There are some people that play Splatoon like crazy. Like, full-on strategy. Um, yeah, it's just, it's really insane. I actually played against, like, a Splatoon team once. Like, these guys were legit, like, taking this seriously. Sabino, how's it going, man? Nice to see you again. We have a full room right now, but, you know, people are always heading out. So, uh, if you want to stand by. Maybe join a room or two.
So guys, I'm thinking we do squads. Let's get out of here. Let's do some squads. Ankly, thanks for coming out. I uh, hope to see you on some more. Some more live streams. Actually, no. Can you only put... All right. All right, Spoilerina, it was very nice to, to meet you. Thank you for the sub if you did decide to sub. Uh, thank you for coming out. Hope to see you in some more live streams coming up in the future. So yeah, I appreciate the uh, you coming out. I think I'm going to switch to the roller next. So Austin, I was going to do squad, but I think you can only do four people. Can, can like this whole room do squads together? Yeah, that's what I thought. I, I would hate to lose some people in the chat, lose their spot at playing. If we lose some people, maybe we can go to squads, but I think for now we're going to do some... I'm really enjoying Splat Zone. I think that that's a cool one, and Tower Control was pretty cool. We'll, we'll pretty much just kind of switch off with the different game modes here. Killed it! Good job, guys!
So this is kind of just a curious question because I mostly use Twitter for news updates rather than like interacting with people, you know, subs that might join me. How many of you guys actually use Twitter? Because I'm not thinking of deleting mine, but I don't know. I, I thought more people would want to join or want to be friends on there, let's just say. But I'm always curious, like, is Twitter a thing? <laughs> I use it ma mainly, like I said, for like news updates. Um, yeah. And I like talking to, to YouTubers that I know and like celebrities like retweeting my stuff. But I'm always curious. Uh, one, two, three, because I am still playing my Wii U. The Wii U, I think, will go down as one of the most underrated consoles of all time. I'm going to, I'm going to put out, put it out there. And I think that might be the case because it's very, very much like the GameCube. In the sense that... It has so many good games. It's an underpowered system. I mean, granted, the GameCube was pretty pretty ahead of its time at the time. But, um, yeah, I, I have to say that the Wii U I've enjoyed more than a lot of the consoles that I've had.
All right. Another splat zone with subs. If you guys want to join, my information is in the description. Chef P. Mac is the Wii U name. I also have my Switch code in the description as well. If you guys want to join me on there. Probably going to be live streaming some arms tomorrow. So if you guys happen to catch me during the test punch, I'd be happy to play with you guys. Damn. We got a close one. This this level is like so much mayhem. Very, very nice. Pretty solid, actually. Splat Zone. Definitely one of my more my my favorite modes in this. No more Splat Zone. Okay. We can change it up. We'll do Terra 4. So, Sabino, yeah, I will be doing uh, streams with Splatoon 2. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be excited. I'm planning on doing some Salmon Run. So, when I do start the Splatoon 2 streams, it might be a little bit harder to join because I think it's only four people. Um, so, yeah, I mean, of course I'll be doing, like, Turf War and stuff like that, too. But I want to primarily do salmon run so if you guys want to add me on switch my code is in the description so whenever you guys know uh when i'll be on i mean of course i'll be announcing when i'll be doing live streams but uh primarily salmon run will be what i will be doing so it's gonna be a little more exclusive when i get splatoon 2 to join but i'll still be going back to this game
Oh, Zeno. Nice. I gotta play more ranked matches. I'm a lot better than what my rank says. Oh my god. <laughs> that was awesome. How's it going, Lenny? Welcome to the live stream. I don't know if you have a Wii U or not, but uh, we do have some open spaces available. Uh, all the info is in the description. Sabino, throwing it down.
Oh no, that is unfortunate, Lenny. I wish you could join. See, I live just with my girlfriend, so I don't have any of those problems. But that is, I couldn't even imagine that. The salt level, way too high. So Lenny, have you got to play it all on your Wii U? I'm kind of curious. Because that would really suck if you couldn't use your Wii U. I know game pads are pretty expensive. Like, last time I looked, they were at least, I don't know, like 90 bucks, I want to say. Last time, well, that was the last time I was looking for one. Just kind of wanted to see the prices on them, but damn. Oh, I'm talking 90 for the gamepad itself. I don't know how much the chargers are. Like the, you're talking about the thing that you put the gamepad on. I don't know. I would, uh, I would just check Amazon or something. Ocean level, ocean level of salt. But yeah, I know the gamepad costs between 90 or 100. I don't know what the actual, like, docking cradle, like, I, I think I know what you're talking about. I don't know how much those are. If I had to guess, though, they're probably going to be expensive because they're so specialized. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. That's a good, it's a pretty good, uh, question. Hope you, uh, hope you can figure that out. God.
You're nuts, Zeno! Although I really haven't played a lot of ranked matches. Actually, I haven't really played a lot of Splatoon in a while. I've just been in Switch heaven. Ariana, all you have to do is add me. I will accept your friend request if you're fast about it. And uh, you could be in as early as next game. That's what I like to see, Lenny. Subscribe uh, for salt removal. You won't be sorry, man. There we go. Sorry about that. Just uh, rejoin. Do we got one more? One more, please. I think we have enough. We should have enough. Oh yes, we are gonna play Rainmaker, actually. I do remember that. Well, looks like we're gonna play with this amount. Let's see. If you guys didn't notice, Hannah and Curtis are pretty much my bodyguards at this point. We are almost always on the same team. And that's because they're OGs, man. Once you subscribe, once you're here for a while, then you then you get that title, you know? You can be on my team full time. Ariana, shit, I forgot. I will add you right after this game. I am sorry about that. 
Gotta remind me. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, we got that double going on. Actually, earlier in the live stream, I got a four kill? Quad kill? I don't know what you call that. But uh, I will upload this video once we are done live streaming. So you guys can re- Pretty long though. I don't, I don't know if anyone re-watches the streams. But uh, yeah. Pretty fun time. The first stream is up there. Four splats in a row, yes, yes sir. It was pretty impressive. Actually, uh, I think actually it may have been, yeah, it was all four and, uh, it was on the, the seeker power up. There's a double. going to add you right now if it's the last thing I do 
You know what? We didn't do half bad for being one man down. We, uh, we definitely held our own. Did I see Mario Maker? What do you mean? So I forgot how bad the gamepad is. In terms of battery so I'm actually having to charge my gamepad in between matches now so if you guys uh, are noticing that I'm taking a little bit of time that's just because I want to keep playing the game so I'm kind of just uh, charging it in between but we'll start I think we're one man down but that's pretty cool whatever Oh, okay, Ariana. Well, good news. Um, I will be streaming pretty frequently. Um, pretty much until ARMS comes out, I'll be streaming uh, Splatoon. After, uh, after ARMS comes out, I'll probably be doing a lot of ARMS streaming. Which will be cool because then it'll give me a, a chance to like take you guys on one-on-one -on -one in ARMS or team battles. Uh, if you guys have it. But uh, yeah, I'll be I'll be streaming Splatoon pretty frequently. I'll probably be doing it like at least twice, two or three times a week. Yeah, definitely. You guys, uh, you guys thinking of getting arms? I don't know if you guys have played the test punch. There's one tomorrow. Uh, I might stream it, but I might also just record the gameplay and use it on a video. But uh, so that's a possibility. I'm definitely gonna get arms though. I've said it from day one. Ever since I saw the game. Uh, that is going to be a day one purchase for sure.
So guys, I think I will be ending the stream at 10. So we could probably get in a few more matches. Um, yeah. I don't know, my gamepad, the battery's kind of low. We'll see, I don't know. I'm thinking 10, but who knows? Oh my God, terrible, terrible, terrible. Like always guys, I would also appreciate if you guys would subscribe to the channel. I'm always doing live streams, mainly Splatoon arms in the future. Also doing Nintendo reviews pretty, pretty daily. I would say at most I skip a couple days. And a lot of bigger things to come. A lot of YouTubers that I've been talking to that I'm looking to collab with to kind of get some different content on there. How's it going, Barry? Welcome to the chat. Welcome to the stream. Oh God, and I'm dead. I think we can all say that Breath of the Wild is probably the best port ever, if that's the case. Um, have you guys played it on the Wii U? I haven't played it on the Wii U. I've only played it on the Switch. Final match. Yeah, I might be getting there too, man. We're going to continue playing a little bit. I might have to turn it off because my gamepad battery is kind of low. I'm charging it in between matches. But I don't think that'll be enough. But thank you guys for coming out. Again, if you want to subscribe to see more videos and to possibly be a part of even more live streams, give me a like, give me a subscribe.
All right, guys, I just want to say thank you for everyone that came out to the live stream. It really, re it really means a lot. And I noticed that we've got a lot of new subscribers since the live stream went live. So I just want to say thank you to everyone that is new and I look forward to seeing all of you guys in future live streams. And again, if you like this content and you have yet yet not to subscribe, I can't even talk. Give this video a like, give my other videos a like, subscribe, and I uh, hope you guys like the content that I put out for you. This will be the last match of the night. So we will be doing this last turf war and then I will be signing out. So thank you everyone for coming out again. Thank you guys so much. This is Patrick from R Wing Attack. Thank you everyone for coming out. You want to join the very last battle? You know what? For you, I will do one more match. How about that? But after that, I really, really do got to go. But uh, look forward tomorrow. I will be posting another video uh, about arms and my first impressions with arms. And then I might... I think that I am, but I might be joining... Or, I'm sorry, streaming arms tomorrow, the test punch... Um, so yeah, if you guys want to add me on Switch, everything is in the description. And, uh, yeah. Lord Bug, you are just in time for the very last match. So after this match, it's going to be the very last match for Maddie, Because he's a pretty cool guy. No one's cooler than you. Come on now.
All right, y'all. So again, thank you for coming out. This will indeed be the last match. I don't think my gamepad can handle more. But uh, regardless, this video will be up on my channel so you guys can re-watch it if you have no lives at all. Thank you guys for coming out. Yeah, Lord Bug, it's crazy. You were there when I had like 20. Spencer, no, oh my God. No, no, that's that's the worst thing I've ever heard. I mean, Game Explain, you gotta give it to them. They do get a lot of news out there first, but I, I don't know, I can't stand Andre. And a lot of what they talk about isn't even, like, real news most of the time. Hey guys, Derek here from Game Explained with a quick update. I don't know what I'm talking about most of the time, but I'm friends with Andre. That's my best impression. I don't know. The Mario Kart stream is canceled. Yeah, I took it down. It, it wasn't that long. And it was kind of, I don't know, I was kind of all over the place. Thank you guys, though. Again, this is Patrick from Arwing Attack. I am signing off. Thank you for everyone who came out to the stream. Thank you for all the new subscribers. I've noticed we got a bunch. But uh, this is Derek from Game Explain <laughs> signing off. Uh, I look forward to seeing you guys more in the future. I will be doing maybe a stream tomorrow, maybe, of ARMS. But uh, thank you very much, guys, for coming out once again.